Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for being here today for my beloved sister's funeral. I just wanted to share a little bit of history about our family, the Tuan family. Our family never had an easy life. We escaped the war-torn country of Cambodia in 1979. We journeyed barefooted through the rugged jungle of Cambodia, full of landmines, venomous snakes, the warlords, seeking a peaceful place to settle. We came upon the Thai refugee camp known as Kavidang. We felt a blessing, having some food to eat daily and not having to worry about the war anymore. Even though we could hear constant gunshots and bombings at a great distance. In the midst of all this, our mother managed to give birth to a baby girl named Kamsat, Lisa. This beautiful girl came to life and she was the biggest joy for our family. That's what I remember. When we got to America with the abundance to eat, we gathered together as a family and feast. This past Thanksgiving, Lisa offered to host dinner at her house for our entire family. But that came up short. After work on Monday, November 20th, Lisa got home from work, she felt dizzy, she took a 5 to 10 minutes nap, and never woke up. While lying in the ICU at Valley Medical Center, we prayed for Lisa to wake up. She never did. If she had, it would have been the greatest joy ever. At times, you don't know how much you miss someone until that person is gone. We miss you, Lisa. I just want to say I love you. We love you, my dear sister Lisa. You're in our hearts and will always be missed. May you rest in peace. May your beautiful soul enter the kingdom of God. Amen. Thank you.